Alright, today I'm going to show you how to make a scalloped edge and I think the techniques I show you here you'll be able to use for a lot of different things but this is a pretty basic way to show you. So I've got my canvas open here in Photoshop and I'm going to make a new layer and then I'm going to get my shape tool and I'm just going to make a circle. If you hold down shift while you make the circle, it'll make a perfect circle instead of an oval. And then I'm just going to use the move tool and drag it over here to the side. And then I'm going to use control J to duplicate it. So now I have two. And I'm just going to do this a bunch of times. Um, okay. So you can see over here I made lots of new layers just hitting control J and I'm going to take this last one and drag it over here and then I have the the top layer selected and I'm going to go down here holding shift select all the layers and I still have my move tool here selected and you'll see up here we have all of these things which we're going to use now first I'm going to click on this one which will align them vertically so they're all in the same line here and then I'm going to use this one which will just distribute them equally across the page so you can see I've got a scallop there and now to finish off I'm gonna make a layer get the rectangle tool and there you go it's a scalloped edge pretty easy. Um, you can do this with all sorts of shapes and it's really handy when you want to spread things out equally. That these up here you can do horizontally and vertically. So it's very handy and I would suggest playing around with these and seeing what different effects you get. One last thing I forgot to mention. Once you have all these layers over here, if you want to make it into a shape mask that you can then clip a paper onto. If you just select them all again using the shift button and then right click say merge layers now they're all the same. So if I get a paper now I can pretty easily just clip that on there and now it's got the scalloped edge. So that's just a quick finishing touch I forgot to mention.